You better believe Cajun County's got a lot of need for diesel technicians, and now new options for education. I'm your Burley Neighborhood Reporter Lorian Nettleton at the Cajun Regional Tech Center where a groundbreaking today signals the start of construction for a new shop. The, the world runs on diesel fuel and that's just the way it is. And... Growing demand in the diesel industry brings new opportunities to the Magic Valley. There's not anywhere in the world or in our county or anywhere you can't go to find something that's related to it and go to work. Chad Evans teaches diesel tech to Cajun County high schoolers currently sharing a shop and classroom space with the automotive instructor. Between the two of them and their students, the shop can get crowded real quick. We've done a lot of good things in here, but it's just, you know, you, you get a semi in here and it takes up half my side of the shop. So Evans is understandably thrilled that Casa Regional Tech Center broke ground on a new 10,000 square foot shop for the diesel program. Well, safety is going to be better. There's not going to be at any given time, there's not going to be 40, 50 kids in this shop, but it's also going to allow me to let a few more kids in. So maybe grow my program a little bit. Chester Bradshaw is the assistant superintendent for Cajun County Schools. He sees students making major career decisions in high school and says this expansion is a way to keep up with how young people are planning their futures. I feel like our challenge as school administrators is to uh, make sure that students understand their options way better so that when they're completed with high school, they have a much better idea of what's out there for them. With six pull-through bays, the days of the 18-point turns to fit the big rigs into the shop are about to be a thing of the past. Yeah, the 18-point turns, I'm getting pretty good at them, but they don't. <laughs> that's, that's one of the difficulties of this shop for the big stuff. The 10,000 square foot shop should be finished by Thanksgiving and ready for the second semester of the 24-25 school year. I'm your Burley Neighborhood Reporter, Lorian Nettleton, Idaho News 6.